Hey guys, PLV here and welcome back to my channel for another video. So a lot of you guys are telling me that you don't have enough time, that school or work is taking up all of your time and that you don't know how to manage both and making music at the same time. And I totally get this because I'm in the same situation as you. So today we are doing a little bit of a different video. I'm going to take you with me for two days and show you everything that I do every day to manage to do everything. I'll show you how I organize my time to stay productive and focused and motivated every day while managing a YouTube channel, content creation on Instagram, learning how to make music, making music, and doing all this while having a full-time job. That's a lot. <laughs> with this video, I just want to show you that it is possible to do it all, that with self-discipline and organization and motivation, you can achieve anything and you can reach your goals. And I also just want to show you my daily life as a beginner learning music producer, so let's go. The first and most important thing that I do is to plan my days ahead. Either the night before or every Sunday evening, I take 30 minutes to an hour to plan my upcoming week. Having my tasks already decided makes me feel less stressed and in control. I start by writing down a list of what I need to do that week, a few objectives so that I can know what I need to do first. After this, I arrange my tasks around the time that I have. Anything between 9 to 6 being taken by my actual work, I have to max out my time before and after work and on weekends. I usually start my day around 7am and finish it around 10pm. I also take an evening here and there free so I can also relax a little bit and spend some time with my family and loved ones. When planning my week, I usually have two typical days. One day is going to be focused on social media content, so writing video ideas, scripting, shooting or editing videos for YouTube, but also creating the posts and videos for Instagram. The other day will be focused on music, so either making music, working on a song, practicing piano, watching tutorials, even reaching out to labels or preparing releases. To maximize the little time that I have available and put some boundaries, I also implemented some rules to help me stay focused and reach my goals. Rule number one, do not check social medias and phone when I am working. You are way more efficient and finish tasks quicker when you are fully focused. Rule number two, do the most hard or annoying tasks first, be done with it. Rule number three, do not procrastinate. Pushing one task to the next day is okay, but not more. Rule number four, I am not allowed to work before 7am or after 10pm. I still want to have some downtime and enough hours to sleep, as it is really important. I do not want to burn out and stop enjoying what I do, so I needed to implement those limits to avoid the hustle and grinding culture and compromise my health. Alright, so usually I start my day around 7am. The first thing I do is to catch up on social media and reply to all the comments and messages on Instagram mostly. I have to be honest, this is not how I would like to start my day, but because of the time zone that I live in, this is the time where most people are active, so hence why I need to take care of my social medias in the early morning. Just before 8am, I start to prepare my Instagram post of the day by writing a description, finding some hashtags, and then I post it at 8am. Sometimes, if I had time in the weekend, the posts are already scheduled to upload automatically, which saves me a lot of time, but today I didn't, so I do it manually. After the social media part is over, I can now start to get some work done. Today I need to continue to edit my YouTube video that I'm going to publish on Sunday. I have very specific tasks on the edit pre-planned as well, so I know exactly what I need to do. For example, this morning I need to gather all the b-roll shots for the voiceover parts. Around 9am I need to stop and start my actual job until 6pm. I work as a lighting and compositing artist for feature animation TV shows. In easier words, I just light the 3D scenes and make them look pretty, it's super fun. At 6pm, right after work, I use one hour more to work on my own stuff before a dinner break. Right now I need to create the thumbnail for Sunday's YouTube video. This is a very funny part for me as this is very close to what I do for work so I really enjoy making them and it's super creative. Alright, so I just finished the thumbnail, it took me approximately an hour so that's perfect and this is how it looks like. Um, but I think by now you should have already seen it because the video must already be out. And if you haven't seen it yet, it'll be right here. And now it's gonna be time for a little break for me and go get some dinner. Alright guys, so it's 8pm now, so it leaves me about 2 hours to continue a little bit. So I'm gonna jump back on the video editing and edit the b-roll shots that we gathered this morning, so let's go.
All right, guys, uh, I think that's enough work for today. Um, I am wiped and I need to get some sleep. Um, I think I did some good progress on the video for a Sunday, so that's good. Uh, now I think I'm just gonna put on a TV show and just fall asleep to it. And on that, good night, and I will see you tomorrow for a music day, yeah! Hey guys, so it's 7 a.m. and I just woke up. Um, as you know, the first thing I'm gonna do is to reply to some messages and comments on Instagram. Uh, and so first I'm gonna do that, and then I think I need to watch a few video tutorials on monthly, uh, which is the masterclass that I'm taking right now. Um, it's the one with blanks, by the way, and it's awesome so far. Um, but I'm gonna do, like the next video will be a full review of this class, so you'll know everything about it. Um, but yeah, music day today, so I'm really excited. Let's go. So from 7.30 to 9 a.m., I do anything music related. This morning is some video tutorials from the class and then a little bit of piano practice and ear training. I use a website called Tone Gym to do my ear training and for the piano at the moment, I just practice some scales and chord progressions. I made a post about it on Instagram if you want more details about it, but after that, I go to work until 6 p.m. All right, so I'm done with work now, so it is finally time to make some music. So the first assignment uh, in the class is to make a cover song, so that's what I'm gonna work on tonight, so let's go. As I only have one hour before dinner time, I'm just cleaning up the project so I can work on the arrangement after dinner, and I'm also starting to mix some of the instruments. For the cover song, I chose to cover Lonely by Justin Bieber. It is a song that I find beautiful and that I think would match the style that I like to produce at the moment perfectly. I chose to go for a very powerful and emotional production using instruments like soft pianos, strings, organs, and cinematic drums to really highlight the emotions of the lyrics. The song is now done and I can't wait to show it to you. And if you pay attention, I think that you can hear the instrumental of it playing just now. All right, so before ending this video, I just wanna add a few more things. First, as you can see, my days are quite packed and it is something that works for me most of the time, but some days, well, it just doesn't. <laughs> if it's too much and that I feel that I need to rest because my body is getting too tired or I'm not in the right headspace, well, I just rest. I take the evening off and I don't feel bad about it. I definitely push myself to reach my goals, but I am not crazy and I won't sacrifice my health for it and no one should. And also, as long as it doesn't happen every day, you're fine and it's completely okay. So yeah, I just wanted to mention this because I've been getting some messages where I think people think that I work like 16 or 18 hours a day, but I don't. Uh, I still have time to watch movies, to go out and see some friends and do some activities. like. I also have some free time. I just organize myself very well, as you previously saw. At the end of the day, you're of course going to have to make some sacrifice if you want to reach your goals, but nothing like compromising your health for it. More things like reduce gaming or don't go out partying every night or things like that. I think the key is just to find a right balance that works for you. And secondly, during weekends, I use the time between 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. to work on my own stuff. Then I keep the full evenings as complete free time. Also, if I need to take a morning off or an afternoon off to go see some friends or do an activity, well, I do so. I don't work full time on weekends. I just probably spend a good 12 to 14 hours, but I keep some free time. But otherwise, that's it. So I hope that this video showed you a bit more how I organize myself and hopefully gave you some tips to also organize your time. If you want more videos to inspire or motivate you, you can check out those videos to learn how to deal with failure or learn how to make music with YouTube. But in the meantime, keep learning and I'll see you in two weeks.